Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Josh from the BitBlock here, and you know what? I kind of feel like casually sitting back and playing a little Rusty's Real Deal Baseball for the Nintendo 3DS. I already reviewed this game, and I gave it a very positive review, but you know, sometimes I just kind of feel like playing a game, and I want you guys to join me. So this is just going to be us casually sitting back and playing some Rusty's Real Deal Baseball. Uh, it just just came out this month on the 3DS eShop here in North America. I'm not sure if it's out. Oh, it is out in Japan. It came out a long time ago in Japan, but it isn't out in Europe yet, and I don't know if it's ever going to come out there. Uh, we're going to go inside of my house, and I'm going to change my outfit because I realize I'm wearing a tuxedo, and that is no kind of outfit for playing some baseball. All right, so what do we got here? We got the farmer thing, which I'm not going to ever wear. That's my favorite, the rusty slugger jacket. You get that from, like, purchasing everything and beating everything, completing the story, in other words. Ninja, this is incredibly strange, a Martian outfit. <laughs> look at that. Uh, cowboy, look at me. I was born to wear that vest. I like that one. It's a pretty good one. That's very baseball-themed. I also, I love the tropical clothing. I still got a lot that I need to unlock. All right, well, I'm going to change into my rusty slugger jacket. You can change the colors. I generally like to go with the, the green. Yeah, we'll wear that. Okay, now we're ready to play some real deal baseball. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to, I feel like playing the game. Figured I'd do some commentary. Uh, I'm sure there are probably some people out there who haven't picked the game up yet. And maybe this could help you decide that you should get it. Look at that! A golden Nintendo 4DS system. Yeah, that's right. You just saw that. And I jumped into it. Because that's how you play games into the future. You jump into them. So we got uh, Cage Match. Let's go into the challenges first. Let's try to beat some of these. Let's go on this one. Fastest fastballs. I gotta score 50 points. That's probably gonna be pretty challenging. Alright, here we go. I gotta concentrate. Whoa, those are fastballs. There we go. Ooh, rainbowiness on the sides. Oh no, the rainbow stuff is distracting me. Oh. oh man, totally whipped it. What? I didn't even score anywhere close to 50. Let's redo it. I really like these uh, batting cage challenges. There we go. There. Now, I should be trying to hit the home run. Which is, oh, there you go. It's a pretty good demonstration. I meant to do that. Or I can also try to hit the ultra machine that is pitching the balls to me. Gives me some points. I feel like I can do this. I think we got this, guys. Oh, I haven't missed one yet. Oh, of course. Of course. Oh, 13 points away. Come on, don't blow this, Josh. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, I'm going to quit that one. I feel like I was close enough. What else we got in here? Basic pitch read. Get a walk. Mega smoke. Let's do mega smoke. Got to score 30 points. What is this one? I think... The, oh, this is where, like, they'll pitch it. Well, you'll see. He pitches it, and then it goes invisible. Or no, yeah, it comes out of smoke. Oh. There we go. Feels really satisfying to hit the ball. Oh, what was that? He's curving him. Wow, that's a really terrible hit. Oh, let's leave the batting cages. I can't take this. I'm 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 gonna throw a fit. I'm gonna charge the mound. All right, let's go back. What did I pick? What category did I jump into? I feel like I picked the wrong thing. Oh, I went to cage match, and I meant to go to bat and switch. All right, we're jumping into the 4DS. You get the golden one, I think, when you uh, complete the story. It's your reward. Let's, um... Let's go for one of the score derbies. Probably shouldn't be playing this one, though, because I've already gotten the gold. Wow, 220 points. Let's see if I can beat it. It's a female ultra machine person. Because equality. Oh, Crowd around, me's, Because I'm socking some dingers. Joshy Thomas style. Come on. Keep them coming. It gets really fast. It's very hard to comment while socking dingers. Ooh, under the leg. It's a move that I created back in my day. But it wasn't for baseball. Oh! Is that an eagle? Oh, oh, the, no, it's a seagull. The seagull distracted me. 
Should we go again? Well, let's go. I'm going to play the one where I don't have a gold because if you get gold medals, you uh, unlock more accessorizings. Clothing. I made that bat myself, by the way. There is a game where you can make your own bat, which is pretty crazy. Ooh. It's the twilight hour. Listen to that bird in the distance. With every hit, the camera grows closer and closer. The music starts to pan in. Yeah. There we go. Sock and a dinger. Sock and a dinger. Sock and a dinger. Sock and a dinger. Oh, boy. You might not know it, you know, unless you're playing it. But this is really satisfying. And it is the type of game that you will play again and again to try and beat your high scores. 72 is my high score. Now, I can't actually miss one. If I miss one, I'm it's over. It's almost rhythmic. It's almost like a Rhythm Heaven game right now. Oh, oh, oh! Oh! Oh, man. She got me. All right. She got me, guys. I was so close to getting my record. I wonder what the gold would be for that. <sighs> she tripped me up big time. What is that? Uh, is it, uh, I guess I can't point it out. I think it just said copyright Nintendo 2014. Nintendo is a little joke throughout this game. Instead of saying Nintendo made these, they were actually made by Nintendo. Let's go with the uh, Volley Bats. <laughs> I like how it's all like, that's the future, but we're still playing on really small, weird little TVs that are even outdated by today's standards. All right, let's go into the challenges for this one. What do we got? Tricky targets, star power, wild footballs. <laughs> juggle boogie. Okay, let's do juggle boogie. I'm actually kind of afraid of what this might be. So this is cool. You are actually controlling both me's oh oh boy this is tricky see the hard thing about commenting while playing this game is that it's very uh tricky but i did it anyway haha -ha, finally i cleared something jeez didn't want you guys to get the impression that i suck oh i got a gold in that too so you get little stamps and eventually that you uh, it earns you things you can also so like if you buy a game from rusty's real deal baseball it's like a dollar 70 somewhere in that range uh you would get 25 normal challenges like you see here and then you also can unlock 25 super hard challenges so you get like 50 challenges each one is pretty addictive i mean you can dedicate a lot of time to these all right here we go Ooh, we're by the seaside that's where i belong this, uh, this me that I'm playing with is actually my little cousin. <laughs> so it'd be very embarrassing if I'm the one who misses the... Whoa. See, if I swing later, I can be way quicker. But if I swing early, it would go higher up. Wow, I destroyed that. Ooh, gold. Goldie's real deal baseball. No, that doesn't work. Hey, I just earned a donut. Donuts are kind of worthless now, though, because I've beat the story. The donuts are used for haggling with Rusty to get lower prices on games, in case you didn't know that. Uh, so once you, like, have everything, the donuts, I, for, as far as I can tell, are pretty worthless. Much like mayonnaise. That's right, I'm attacking mayonnaise in this video. Let's do uh, tricky targets, 15 hoops. And then we'll move on to maybe one or two more. I don't know, who's in a hurry? We're not in a hurry, we're playing Rusty's Real Deal Baseball. Oh, so this one's really cool. You got to go through the hoops. So timing is everything in this one. Uh, lower the hoop is the sooner, or actually the later you want to swing. Come on, Mackenzie, what are you doing? Come on, Joshy, what are you doing? There we go. I'd look to see how many hoops I got to get it through, but then I'd take my eyes off the prize here. You do have three hearts, so I can miss three times. All is looking pretty well. Yeah, I like how there's actually programming. There's programming on... Oh, jeez. There's programming, like, when you hit the ring. So you do have to go through it. You can't just, like, touch the ring. There we go. Two more. 
Get it up. Get it in there. Oh. There we go. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get a gold for that, though, because, that, yeah. So, yeah, that is, uh... Ooh. That's, what, that's another one of the games. I think there's ten in all. That's Volley Bats. That's a good one. I like that one. I would recommend it. There's maybe a couple of them that I wouldn't recommend. Like, I don't think I would recommend the Batmaster thing, because it's just, it's just making a bat. It's cool, but it's probably not, like, worth the... If you're, like, being picky with what you buy, that might be one you can skip. That's what I'm trying to say here. Let's do Make the Call. I like this one. You get to be an umpire. I've never wanted to be an umpire ever! Said everyone. Alright. Let's do some challenges. Let's do uh, the hard count. It's the only kind of toughness that I like when I'm counting things. Hard. Use the touch screen to play. Yeah, I know this. Alright, so this is like you just call the pitch. Like, what would it be? Oh, that's a strike. That's a strike again. So you got two strikes. Boom. New batter. Get him out of here. Okay, that was a strike. That was a strike. Ooh, that was a foul. Uh oh, what? Yeah, I, I, that was a foul ball, but it didn't give me the option to say foul. Oh, why'd you swing at that? You. So that's two strikes. Two strikes and a ball. It looked like. Yeah. Oh, we cleared it. So uh, that's one of the versions of being an umpire. But there's actually a better version of being an umpire. <laughs> Makes no sense. Uh. I think it's one of the, it's got, it's got to be the first call for Let's do one of the more difficult ones. We have the, no, I don't have the easy, the very difficult ones unlocked. Let's do this one. Pro batter's eyes. Basically describes my eyes. So now I actually have to guess the, the type of pitch. And you have to do it real quick because you'll get more points. See, that was a sinker. That was a fastball. That was a fastball. Oh, that was a curveball. That was a sinker. Gotta get 30 points. That's a... Oh, no, that was... Oh, jeez, that was a forkball. The forkball looks a lot like the fastball. Curveball. That was a forkball. That was a forkball. That's a sinker. It sounds stupid, but it's very satisfying to hit the ball in this. They, they, like, made the timing beautifully, and the sound effect sounds really good. It just feels good to hit balls in this game. I only got a B. I only got a silver for that. Kind of disappointed in myself and a lot of other things right now. Ooh, high score derby. Oh, hey! You've collected 30 stamps playing Making the Call. So now we can go play. Let's do that. That little dog is adorable, by the way. I like him. He's my buddy. Can't remember his name, though. Oh, now that was the voice of an umpire. Ooh, it's raining. Time to put your eagle eyes to the test. I do have eagle eyes, by the way. I can spot a penny from across the state. Gotta identify the pitches. Oh, this is just like what I did before. All right. That's a slider. It's a fastball. Oh, so the second I mess up, I'm done with. I'm gonna be really focused. I like how I'm playing as a lady. She's not really dressed for the occasion. It's really good music in this game. I dig the. I really dig the tunes here. Level three. As a forker. As a slider. Oh, the answer was fork ball. Oh, it's oh man, the fork ball always forks me up. All right, all right, let's go back. Let's let's do another category. I think we'll do one more, and uh, we'll end this just before maybe about 18 minutes or so. I just wanted to give you guys a chance to see some Rusty's Real Deal Baseball outside of the review. I got a donut. Man, can you believe? Can you imagine if Nintendo really made a handheld system that shot out sweet succulent donuts? It'd be the best system ever. Well, let's go into gear games. I don't even, I don't know if I ever showed those in the review, actually. I want to do the, um, the good variety, so we're going to do the aim game. 
some reason I grab my crotch when I jump into the 4DS for some reason. What's going on in the 4DS that I need to shield my crotch? I don't know. But I want to know. What is this? I've unlocked it and I haven't even played it. Look at that face. The aim game. Vision. Uh, hit the targets and go for high score. Oh, actually, I the uh, what? Where, where's the targets? Okay, okay. Ooh, middle is three. <laughs> there we go. So this is great because it really does have to do with the timing when you swing. You want to kind of ah, oh, you want to hit it just right to get the middle. There we go. Well, I don't want any of those. Am I going for a certain amount of points? Oh no, this is just a high score derby. So as long as I don't miss, we're good. And, you know, if you guys have this game yourself, you can try to beat my high score that I get here. Gotta warn you, it's gonna be super duper hard to do. I'm gonna swing early. So if I swing early, I'll get the one on the right. Oh, not early enough. That, but oh, I'm okay with that. That was three points. What am I doing? I'm usually terrible at hitting in the center. Oh! Oh no, that doesn't count. Oh, no. There we go. I don't know. I'm doing pretty decent. Really wish I would stop getting the ones! Uh, she always trips me up with these crazy... When do I lose? Oh, I see what was happening there. There were hearts that I wasn't looking at. <sighs> that actually wasn't the one that I want, thought it was, though. I haven't played this game in a while, so I'm a little confused by what is happening. Super long throws. All right, let's try this. We'll do a couple more here. We'll do this one. Yeah, this is what I wanted to do. So this one's cool. Because you use the motion control to aim, press A to throw. Oh, wow. Missed the main. So obviously there's more points in the center. So you really want to try hard. Oh, well, could you get more perfect than that? Answer, no. So it gets further back every time. Oh, wow. No, we don't need a replay of that. Oh, I just missed it. No, 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 what is going on here? No, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Accidentally hit A. That's really stupid of me. That'll make up for it. Oh, that was a that was a dead-on target. It's a good way to end this video. So yeah, guys, that's Rusty's Real Deal Baseball. I reviewed it already at the Bit Block, gave it a very positive score. Um, it's, you know, the type of game where you can actually buy each one of these games individually for like a, like I said, like a dollar seventy or so, you actually haggle with Rusty. There's 10 of them in all, and uh, yeah, if you haven't checked it out, do so, because it's actually free to download, and then you pay for whatever content you want, and these are all the games. It's pretty cool. I really like it. It's like the perfect little summer eShop game on your Nintendo 3DS. Hey, thanks for watching this video from the BitBlock. If you want to stay up to date on tons of exclusive Nintendo content, be sure to subscribe by clicking here. And if you don't want the fun to end, you can check out more Nintendo coverage by clicking over here.